Yo Mr. Toymob, my name is Rayo and welcome to my new YouTube channel where I help you turn your passion towards gaming into a career by creating content and building your own personal brand. So if you know that gaming is one of your biggest passions and you have that itch somewhere that's itching <laughs> and it tells you go pursue your dreams, go pursue your passion but you don't really know where to start how to start or even if you should start. Then not only this video, but this whole channel is just for you. So make sure you subscribe with the notification bell on and leave a like on this video so the YouTube algorithm will push it to the people who need to see it as well. All right, starting off, the reason you need to make content as a gamer is because think about how awesome it would be if you could turn your passion towards gaming into a career. I remember I was like 14 years old or something when I dreamed about becoming a full-time gamer or whatever you want to call it uh, to me it sounds pretty on point but uh, unfortunately it wasn't until I was 23 years old that I started to take this seriously and I actually started pursuing it and making it happen so I don't want you to make the same mistake as I did being scared of pursuing something that you really love just because you're afraid that you're gonna fail no I want you to start now don't wait because to be honest, you don't need 1 million subscribers or 100,000 subscribers to be happy and make a living from it, no. You can make money and be happy with much, much less than that. Just ask yourself, how much would your life change if right now you had 100,000 subscribers on your YouTube channel? Probably a lot, right? Well now, imagine how much your life would change if you had only 10,000 subscribers. Still a lot, you know, you'll probably be a lot happier than you are right now. It doesn't take that much to be happy and successful. And to prove it, let's just take this to another level. Think about how happy you would be right now if you would get your YouTube channel monetized and you could finally start earning passive income. I remember when I got my CSGO focused uh, YouTube channel monetized and I don't know the word in English to describe it, but it was amazing. I remember it was at that point where I thought to myself, wow, I am now truly a content creator. <laughs> I was really proud and it was exciting. So think about it. How many subscribers do you realistically need in order to be happy? Leave your comment down below. All right, another reason you need to make content as a gamer is that maybe you want to become recognized by people around you or in, in your favorite game. There's nothing wrong with that and many of us would love to earn some level of fame or recognition. Content creation is the perfect way to achieve that. And again, you don't need a million subscribers or hundreds of thousands of subscribers to, to be recognized. It really only takes a couple hundred, maybe a couple thousand subscribers before you meet someone in the game and they're like, hey, aren't you that guy who makes those YouTube videos? Yeah, yeah, that's me. Nice. Thanks, bro. That's, that's basically how it goes. <laughs> but anyways, you can become famous or recognized in your favorite game and this actually brings me to another topic by creating content and building your own personal brand you can have an impact in the gaming world this really means once you get to a certain point uh, where you're big enough and you have something to say about anything really people will listen this could for example mean that there's a really bad update in your favorite game and you hate it uh, all, everyone hates it and you make a video about it you make a tweet about it i don't know and maybe the game developer notices that your video, your tweet, whatever, they take their notes and they actually go on and change the game. Think about that, you have a real influence over a game that you really love. That's pretty amazing. All right, so let's see how creating content and building your personal brand will affect your real life situations. First thing that comes to my mind is that you will no longer have a boss because you are your own boss. You're, you're basically free. If you're currently at your 9 to 5 job that you don't really enjoy and you never, you're never looking forward to Mondays because you hate the, the fact that you have to go back to work again when all you really want to do is just chill at home and play some video games. Well, good news my friend. Once you start creating gaming content and you slowly start building up your personal brand, you can basically play video games full time. How awesome is that? And this actually brings me to another point and that is by building your own personal gaming brand you decide yourself how you want to spend your time. You basically create your own freedom. Like you could basically play video games all day long if you want, if you feel like it. I know I did it, it's fun, 
uh, until it's not, but it's an option. But the point here is that your time is not restricted by somebody else. You don't need to wake up at 6 a.m. just so you can get ready for the bus uh, so you could get to that meeting that's early and you don't really care about. Or if I take myself as an example here, uh, this will this will this will sound like I'm whining here on the internet and crying about some silly stuff, but it was real to me. So here it goes. Um, when I worked at a 9 to 5 job, I used to go to the gym a lot, but the only time I had to go to the gym was between 5 and 6 p.m. So after after my work, and this was the time when the gym was the most packed it ever is, ever was, ever is, I don't know. And I absolutely hated it. I know it sounds silly, but I hated the fact that I had to wait 10 minutes in line for the bench press or that I needed those dumbbells that this random dude was using at the exact same time. It was, <laughs> it was miserable. And luckily right now I can just go whenever I want. And usually I go after people have had their lunch break. So that's like 2 to 3 p.m. Because then, then the gyms are mostly empty and it's, I can have the gym all by myself, which is very nice. All right, so moving on, it actually brings me to another point, which is that you will never be affected by things that happen outside, the, the external stuff. Because if you create gaming content and you build your personal brand, then everything you do is online. You don't need to worry about anything that happens offline. That's pretty clever. Look at what's happening right now. We're in a crisis. Schools are closing. People are losing their jobs. And people are right now just sitting at their homes doing basically nothing. Well, by nothing I mean they're watching YouTube videos. They're watching their favorite streamers. And this is really good. In times like this, you don't lose money. You make more of it. So I think this is an extremely important point because it's basically more secure than the 9 to 5 jobs that people are saying that are safe. All right, so at this point, you might be thinking that this is pretty cool and all, but you don't really know if you should start doing it. You don't really know how to do it. And you're still kind of in between because you're not sure you could make it happen. If that sounds like you, then make sure you subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell as well, because my next video, I'm gonna be telling you exactly what to do in those situations where you don't really believe you could make it as a gaming content creator. Also, because this is a new YouTube channel where I help gamers turn their passion into a career by creating content and building their own personal brand, then leave a comment down below and let me know what would you like me to talk about in this channel in the future. I'm sure you have some really good ideas and until then, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. GG.